It's been an important crop for most of our country's history, but recently some laws were put into place by the state of Kentucky and also the federal government to allow certain states to grow it within a research framework, which is usually referred to as the pilot program. The fibers contained on the uh, outside of the stalk actually, so you can see the white interior and the fiber, which now is green, I'm peeling it off the stalk, but it would be, when dried, it would be a, a brownish color when it was processed. But it is a strong fiber, uh, can be very long as they grow up these long stalks. We really didn't know what to expect. We can read about Canada's hemp production or hemp production in Europe, but we're in a very different geography. We have different ratios of daylight and dark in the summer. We have different growing seasons, differing soils. Since it hasn't been grown much, basically none in this state since World War II, things have changed a lot agriculturally since then. Have different varieties, uh, there were no pesticides or fertilizers. And we're just trying to take this old crop that's kind of newly reestablished and determine some best management practices for the farmers in Kentucky.